To determine the appropriate collar size, select the Miami Junior collar size based upon Braslau Luton color code or age using the label on the packaging or wall chart. We recommend patients 13 and older to use the Miami J. Ensure that correct spinal protocol is followed throughout the application. Position the patient with arms to the side, shoulders down, and head centrally aligned. Ensure the Sorbitex padding extends beyond the edge of the plastic. Note the arrows on the panel pointing up. Anculation buttons on the posterior shell are always shipped in the upright and locked position. This will be the best anatomical fit for most patients. At the discretion of the clinical team, unlock and adjust while it is off the patient, following skin checks. If used, remove the pillow and slide the collar back behind the patient's neck and center it. Long hair should be placed outside of the plastic shell. Note the arrow on the panel pointing up. Ensure the Sorbitex padding extends beyond the edge of the plastic. Angulation buttons may be used to fine-tune the fit of the collar for better anatomical conformity, pressure distribution, and comfort of the chin support. Unlock, slide up, and lock to relieve chin tip pressure or discomfort. Slide down to relieve jaw or mandibular pressure or discomfort. The sternal pad may be removed if the anatomy dictates, for comfort during sleep and or during meals to make chewing and swallowing easier. Flare the sides of the front out, slide it up the chest wall, and scoop it up under the chin. Sides of the collar front should be oriented up, off the trapezius, and towards the ears. While holding the front securely, curl the ends snugly against the patient's neck. With the front of the collar inside the back, apply the hook and loop strap and secure the opposite side of the collar in the same fashion. Tighten straps alternately to an equal length on both sides. Hook and loop straps must be aligned to the front adhesive sections. Excess may be trimmed. <laughs>